Well, over a thousand outages today in Cleveland County after this week's ice storm. Intergy officials say they are working the best they can to deal with the outages. Our Ty Lisa Hampton went out to see the progress being made to restore power. It was a little surreal. Everything was icy and things were crackling and, and I thought the sky is falling. But it was power lines coming down Thursday morning in front of Phyllis Kelly's home under the weight of all that ice. Oh yes, it was very alarming, you know, living in a heavily wooded area like we do here in Ryzen. Uh, you never really know the stability. The destruction seen a day later. Just seeing them on the ground was was alarming. Kelly's house is one of thousands in Cleveland County waiting for power to be turned back on. Uh, it was just a swath right there. Cleveland, Drew, Lincoln, uh, just to see, you could just draw a circle. The calls energy says the ice covered trees unable to hold the weight falling and taking out power lines. You know, thankfully, we've had a lot warmer weather today, which has allowed our crews to be able to assess the damage a lot quicker. Um, but they're still um, having to be cautious because as that warmer weather happens, the ice is beginning to melt and tree limbs are still falling in areas that we're working. Other trees coming down on homes and blocking roadways. Uh, we've been out two days. Elizabeth Harrington says they have a generator, but no power because it ran out of gas. They're trying to get out to get more. Well, this is the first time we tried. We couldn't even get out till today and it started falling. Thankful a nearby gas station is open. We had two cans of gas already for the generator. Keeping their food fresh. Oh, it's going to help us have uh, electricity to keep our refrigerator and freezer charged. Kelly says they're leaning on other backups as well. Waiting for power to be restored, Kelly says they're keeping themselves busy and being patient. Just cooking food, um, running heaters. We have a little uh, little radio, the old-fashioned radio, that we can um, entertain ourselves that way. All your favorites.